Greetings, Massive Van Crew. It's yours truly, Nico Rebel, back in the building. Yo, we wanted to share a quick tip on one of my favorite reverbs right now, and that's the LX480 from UAD. They came out with their recreation of this iconic reverb a few months back. And I'm here working on this new track from Young Coco Musgrave. And for some reason, it just fits so well. This reverb fits so well with the track. So I wanted to show you guys a little bit of my process and then see if maybe you guys could hear something in the reverb that appeals to you as well. So right now we have the track in um, the default stage of how the LX480 starts. I song go like Gretzky. Nim They'll check me. She gon' bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a tempest dog. You're the runner up on a champion. Doing what you do, but it can't be done. Alright, so that vocal already sounds great with the with the LX480 from UAD as the right off the back factory default settings. So I'm gonna go in and show you guys a little bit how I use this plugin and how we navigate through the plugin. So how we get to this first, you have different banks. So you can cycle through the banks and then you'll get like the play, the illusion, the voice doubles, cause this reverb is known for its vocal effects and what it adds to vocals you have the grand hall you have the music club again and then you have sub programs which is like large ambience the medium ambience the strong ambience the heavy ambience and you can kind of cycle through the programs and the banks that way so you have now the car interior a quick way that i like to approach it as well is just going up here so once you go here, you kind of get some ideas of the different banks, right? So we're going to go all the way back to a plate because for some reason, right now I'm digging vocal plates on um, vocal plates. Yeah. <laughs> I just love plates on vocals right now. So let's look at this right now. So let's start with a fat plate, some of the reverb settings, and then it has different types of subgroups so whether it's the effect the wild spaces or whatever so let's start here and then we'll kind of cycle through some of the settings and then we'll fine tune it so i'm going to turn up the reverb so we can hear a true effect of what's happening i song go like gretzky Nim they'll check me she gonna bust it down for the belly i'm gonna break her off for a tempest dog all right, that's pretty cool. A little bit too much, but still cool. So right here, you could adjust the reverb time. I song go like Gretzky. Nim, they'll check me. She gonna bust it down for the Bentley. So if you want a shorter reverb time, you adjust this lever down. The shape, the spread, how wide you want it, and the size is how many meters. It's measured in meters. And then many of us, we put a equalizer on our reverbs to tail the high end frequency. So it already has one built in right here. Then we have the pre-delay. Pre-delay is super important in regards to giving vocal space. So we're gonna play around with this and see what we could come up with. So let's hear this. I song go like Gretzky, Nim, they'll check me. She gonna bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a tempest, dog. You the runner up on a champion. Doing what you do, but it can't be done. I song go like Gretzky. Nim, they'll check me. She gonna bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a tempest, dog. You the runner up on a champion. Doing what you do, but it can't be done. I song go like Gretzky. Nim, they'll check me. She gonna bust. So this is one of the things that I love so much about this reverb. This reverb adds so much space, but it's so easy to use. And it's basically like seasoning to taste, right? So we're gonna play it with the reverb and without the reverb. Also, we have some knobs here, which is like wet solo, if you want it 100% wet, or if you want the mix to be a mix between dry and wet. And then, you know, the power button, which is the bypass, UAD's version of the bypass. So let's listen to it. I song go like Gretzky. Nim They'll check me. She gonna bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a tempest, dog. You All right, let's bypass the reverb. I song go like Gretzky. Nim, 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 they'll check me. Instantly, you could feel the vocal lose that excitement, that space that the lexicon is giving it. I song go like Gretzky. Nim, 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 
Bell check me. She gon' bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a 10 piece. Dog, you the runner up on the champion. Doing what you do, but it can't be done. I so check it out right now. They also have a special feature where you could unlock this part where this was something that they used to do back in the days where you could actually use a screwdriver and kind of turn up or turn down the input and output gain and link it. I rarely go to this option, but it's definitely great to have it. Also, I forgot to mention that you have the A and the B settings, so you could toggle between which two settings you prefer the most. So let's hear it. I song go like Gretzky. Name they check me. She gon' bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a 10 piece dog. You the runner up on the champion. Doing what you do, but it can't be done. So let's hear how it fits in context with the mix. I song go like Gretzky. Name they check me. She gon' bust it down for the Bentley. I might break her off for a 10 piece dog. You the runner up on the champion. Doing what you do, but it can't be done. Yeah, guys, so definitely give thanks. Feel free to leave a review, subscribe, drop a line. Yo, we're going to drop more content to you guys daily, weekly. Yo, if you guys have any questions, drop a comment below. Boom! Music.